The cold is utterly relentless, y'all. It's holding on and it ain't letting go. We will persevere none the less. Lately, I've been convincing myself to actually go for these runs by telling myself, it's just a light run. You don't need to run very hard. You don't even need to break a sweat. Just get out there and you know, get your blood moving a little bit. Enjoy your podcast. Accidental Tech Podcast. Talk about that Mac Pro rumors, baby. Oh my God. I gotta go get another coat, it's too cold. So cold. Two coats, baby. Wind just feels colder today. I don't know, man. It's... My watch is telling me it's 30 degrees Fahrenheit, but man, it feels colder than that today. I don't know if it's the wind chill or maybe I'm just a pansy or both. Could be both. I've always been a very good jumper, so all of my life when I've seen other people struggle to jump, it's kind of like, what's the problem? <laughs> and I know that's ridiculous, but I have been put even more in their shoes lately because I can't really jump that well anymore. I can jump okay, but I can see how it would be difficult to jump if you don't practice it all the time. It's just like the muscles just aren't there for it. Anyways, shorter run today, let's go. Let's go eat hot dogs. <laughs> hot dogs, get your hot dogs. So I was asked yesterday if that feeling of relief and just freedom after I finish an episode was still there. It is amazing how quickly that feeling dissipates and becomes, I need to figure out what I'm doing next. So slightly longer term, we're working on doing something fairly bigger for the next episode, or maybe next two episodes. In short term, I'm looking for somewhere to do a solo hike. It is very cold outside still, and getting the vaccine is like just around the corner. I don't wanna get the virus right before the vaccine. That would really suck. <laughs> if I was gonna get it, I wanted to get it like last March. That would have been fine. Well, no, it would have been fine. It'd be better than getting in now though, that's for sure. So before I got this car, I was asking various people about their thoughts on getting a new car or a used car. So I talked to my cousin Danny and he had recently gotten a new car and he was saying, honestly, I look for excuses to drive my car. That's how nice it is. <laughs> and. Lately, that's how I feel too. I'm like, man, do I need to go drive anywhere? It is just really nice. And let me tell you, electric, man, if you can get an electric car, get a plug-in hybrid, man. I'm telling you, it offers all the benefits of electric and gas. It is time to give these microphones a shot. We're gonna put this camera on the gimbal. We're gonna go outside and we're gonna see how they sound. It totally remains to be seen if this is a viable method of recording, if it's gonna sound good, if it's worth it. That's what experimentation's all about, baby. Got experiment. me feels like maybe this is stupid, but the other part of me is, no, this could be pretty cool. I don't know, I have to see what it looks like and sounds like. Because if it looks and sounds really good, this is great. But if it's just kind of mediocre, I mean, who cares, you know? Okay, this is gonna require some more testing. Let's go to my usual testing park and give this a test. 
hundreds in deaths than the previous three months. But I Okay, this very well could work, but I'm gonna have to take a look at the footage and see what it looks like and sounds like. Might have to do some tweaking, but this could be pretty cool. Go to a cool park, do like an hour long nature walk or even 30 minutes. I, I could watch it. <laughs> be a great sleep aid. I may need to do it when it's a bit warmer outside though, because uh, it is really cold or at least wear some gloves. Oh. Okay, um, I kind of don't have anything left in me in the tank today. So that's gonna do it for today's vlog. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> yes. Yes.